Stealth charm. Burning an enemy has a 15% chance to terrify. Not bad if you use the, uh... Well, it might be bad. I don't know. I haven't really used the actual... Uh, fire sword skill yet in combat. I don't know how easy it is to just burn them with that. Maybe... It probably is pretty easy because I would imagine that the reason it was unblockable during the, uh... Duel itself is because you still catch on fire. Right? So maybe it just makes... I, I, I could also just read the technique. Uh, this one. Kills may terrify nearby enemies. That doesn't really help me much. They may terrify, and then I guess the charm just makes that terrify percentage chance increase a bit more. But I mean, if it's... I would imagine the most useful thing would be if it's unblockable. Looks like a dual spot. There's like a dude over there. I can go there from over here. This is just a spot where duels happen, not one that I can actually duel anyone. It's intriguing. It's not even like an actual location. Uh, I need to... So what's this signboard? I need to get on horse because this is a bit farther away than I thought it would be. A Foxton. Good. Come on, friend. I'm assuming this one will actually... Oh, bear. I think that's too far up. No. Made a terrible mistake. Bear's dead. I shot an extra arrow just to be safe. Didn't mean to. I just released a button poorly. Uh, Fox? Friend? I was fighting a bear. Sorry. Got distracted by the bear. We'll get maximum damage. Maximum health. So I think it's... Let's look at it real quick. It's at a... Um, moderate now? Moderate. So I think it will upgrade to major. And I don't know if it will upgrade any more after that. I'm assuming... Like one more charm... Upgrade for stealth. And then maybe we get a like... Bonus mask or helmet or something like how we got a bonus mask for completing the mythic quests. Maybe that'll be what we get for getting the rest of the statues. Oh, it's up there. Got a little too ahead of myself, Fox friend. Sorry. Nice. I don't see Fox Friend. No petting from me then. Major, yay yeah, boy. Good stuff. Five more to increase charm power, and then the other five would do something. <sighs> We're right here. I'm sorry. I Forgive me. I keep saying main story will do it. And then I kill myself by falling. But we're like right here. Might as well do it now. It's the last thing too. The last Mongolian piece. 
And we'll at least fill out most of map. At least as far as like places to fast travel quicker to. I just feel like it's close enough. And it's a brewery. We can get drunk afterwards. Sign me up. There it is over there. Hopefully we won't have some dumb task to do. I was going to say there's some crazy glowy stuff happening, but that's probably just fire. Wouldn't be the first time I thought a crazy glowy thing was something magical and it was just fire. Probably won't even be the last. Alright, we're gonna probably just have to rescue, right? Half bow kills. Okay. Might be a little difficult because they probably all have helmets on. How many people are around? You weren't supposed to see me. Uh, restart checkpoint. I don't- he just turned around quick. Let's try that again. I was trying to see if I can maybe, like, keep him by himself so I can half-bow him to death. Where am I? This is definitely not where I started out. How do I even get down from here? Also, is that a shrine? Well, I'm gonna climb up that then. Just because the game kind of... Do this at me. Shouldn't be like a real shrine. Doesn't look like it's really that far up. Is it? There was a Tory gate there. No. Might be a side quest related thing. I can't do anything about it, but I guess maybe this might be a better angle at going over here because I should be able to grapple onto that uh, house, maybe? It's a little too far away. I don't think I'd be able to grapple. That is a death sentence. If I've ever seen one, heard one, imagined one. But this is a uh, good way to... Attempt to climb down, I guess. Okay, he is going to be an easy target. No one even knew. Let's climb in here. Some minor visions. Oh, God. Oh, that was good enough to kill you. I didn't think that would be. Get whatever I was trying to do then. That was a lot easier than I anticipated. Who's over there? It's like a big shield man. Who's gonna get big? Assassinate it! 
I love how the animation for that is always through the back, like they're leaning against it. Even though he was coming like towards the the door. I I assumed half bow wouldn't be enough to kill anyone. Cause that seemed to be like what the point was with the uh, longbow and its heavy ammo. What a fool I am. Also, it is way too bright out there. Can barely see a thing. Alright, so I saved you. Everyone else is definitely over here. Chain. I'm surprised that chain worked. Surprised you took that long to see me. What a hero I am. They are close. Help me. That was the last one. You would think that they would at least tell you, right? The, um... The hostages, if they know that there's more people around, they'll say, no, there's a guy in that room. And not like that doesn't have to be the, the dialogue specifically saying over there. Well, yeah, just have them say there's a guy over there still. There are people still over that way. And then they'll like mark it on the map or something. So you know who else you have to assassinate. I don't know. Food for thought. They obviously know that there's someone still around. There like someone under me? Yeah. Please. Okay. This is where I learned that crawling under here wasn't the best idea. What's uh, your deal, mister? That didn't quite work well. That wasn't how that was supposed to play out. But I think that was the guy that was in here. Um, You would think that like that crawl through would have some kind of... Stealth kill thing you could do, maybe. Back up here. If he gets close enough, I should be able to triple kill, right? Like this. And then there's just a guy in the other room. Oh, yeah. Okay, and then one more guy. Had more time to change stances there. I feel like I'd have a lot better time with stance changing in general if it was just relegated to the D-pad without having to press a trigger. Which maybe is part of the minor difficulty of it. I say minor because it's mostly my fault for... Struggling at times. Alright, there is a dude in there. And then uh, ghosting because I wasn't sure if there was anyone else around. And we might as well go uh, full force here. Okay, we good? Nope. You surprisingly didn't see any of that, though? Back off. Ooh. Fuck you. Mmm, fuck you. 
I uh, did a bad block and then everything else went bad. And now there's an arrow man too. There you are. Is that it? No. What is seeing me? Is there a dog down there? Oh god, there's a dog over there? Sorry pupper, gotta get snuffed. Alright, we're good. I mean, lethal mode is lethal. Couple bad hits and you're just effed. Also, there's not much else I can do about it now because there's a lot less chances to get more help. Are you going to give me like the actual body armor bit? This one. Yeah, I think that's like shoulder pads. Nice. I want to collect a pelt. Not bad. Gonna take a long while before we can actually get our... Um... Skills up. I mean, a lot of the story quests are like major legacy points, right? What am I doing? Just looking for supplies, Jin? That doesn't really look like you're doing anything at all. Alright, well, we got some supplies from it. One question mark over here. Let's grab that and then we'll return to the shrine. I don't even care what horse I get. I don't need any horse. This might have been mine. But it doesn't matter which one I... I want to go that way, don't I? doesn't matter which one I'm on because it's not my horse. It's just a random horse. Could be anyone's horse. This is the way I'm going, right? Yeah, it's working out. It's working out right. Uh, Also, skill. I have a skill point. Get this one. Oh, is that a... Hospring, nice. What can we think about next? How Uncle is like, oh, I want to be your dad, but you aren't allowed to be a ghost. And I'm like, hey, I can do what I want. I'm old enough. You're not my real dad. Storm off. Uh, invaders. Those are kind of basic things. The hot spring must feel real nice in this cold. Nice. Little knob, not quite as good as the uh, one I got from the level up. I would consider it a level up. I think it's fair to consider it a level up. Trapper's house. Is intriguing. I wanted to discover that, but I got real distracted. I, I that's the last thing I swear. Get our Khan armor, Mongolian armor, and then we'll. Uh, I I really want to be able to go to the other map too. So that's like, that's the main reason I want to do this quest. Oh, is that it over there? Looks like it's a, uh... Pillar of Honor. Need to be a little careful because there's Mongolian horses there and hopefully it's easy enough to swim. Oh, 
Ah, they're coming along this way. Actually, no, they're going up the dock there. I think we'll be good. I just, I'm glad because we'll be able to replace our stupid sword kit that we have on right now. For possibly another stupid one. This one, is that like just fire? No, it's... Yeah, that's basically just fire. That's nice. It's a little goofy, but it's nice. You know I gotta. It's a bamboo thing. Perfect. Honestly. I think we need two more after this. But then it's like, oh, well, you know, you could get that upgrade so you can see where they are. I'm surprised I wasn't sure how many buttons I actually pressed. Yeah, two more. Like, because it was just circle, circle, L1, 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 triangle, triangle. That's a very easy thing to memorize. But then I'm like, oh, did I press enough L1s? Oh, no. No one really knows. I, uh, up here. To you. Also, it's always nice to get armor because, you know, it might have some cool stat things that it does. At this point, I kind of am mainly just wearing armor for the aesthetic. I haven't had too much bad luck with, uh... With not worrying about that. I don't know where the guy is. Where... There he is. I, am, I haven't really been thinking about changing armor for situations I might struggle with. Which is fine by me. I think aesthetic I like more. But you know, having more aesthetic is nice as well. Put it together. Better look sick. Oh. That is pretty sick. Not bad, actually. I'm into it. I didn't... It's designed for code and con. I guess they he fitted it for me. I was going to say, it looks very tiny. Major increase to health. Reduces all damage by a major amount. Disguises you while out of combat. Massively reducing Mongol detection speeds. So they will eventually detect... Oh, and it is a different mask. Who cares? Ha, surprise, I'm a Mongol. Uh, where's the... Do I not have the materials to... Upgrade this? Or is this one that doesn't get upgraded? Uh, it looks like it's not one that gets upgraded. I guess... Ooh. I guess it's just... The way it is. Uh, probably can... Yeah, there's no armor options for it. Okay. So, like, really defensive might be cool. How does this look with, like, a... Okay, it looks a little bit like eyes wide shut when you don't have the helmet on. It doesn't really work. It kind of works okay there, because you can't see it. Um, let's return to the ghost. I wish there was an easier way to find things when you have so many helmets. Is it just called the ghost headband? So I probably went past it. Ghost headband. Yeah, I went past it. Uh, I know the ghost was up front here. Because it's like the real game armor. 
Uh, did he have... I think the merchant had colors for a set that I didn't have yet. Was it this one? No, I don't think so. It looks like these are all the same stuff. Also, bird. I heard bird around. Is there like a bamboo spot somewhere? Maybe up there. I didn't go up that way. Was bird leading me to the shrine? No, bird's leading me over here. Got a little confused. I need to trust bird more often, even though sometimes he annoys me and makes me want to crush his soft bird skull. I don't think they're soft, just hollow. Thin, so they can be aerodynamic. Oh, another... Uh... This one's going to be dumb, isn't it? I just got one that's like pretty cool looking. Looks dumb. It's kind of okay. It's not the worst. I was thinking about maybe not even equipping it. It's fine. Okay. What were we doing? A real story mission. Right. How could I forget? Main reason, again, we wanted to do this was so I can explore everything else. Because guess what? If this unlocks the rest of the maps, we're not going to be doing story missions for a bit. I just want to be able to go back and do those missions that I skipped out on. Because I didn't expect to be in like a point of no return situation. And then we're just going to do loads of side quests. I'd assume too part of why we need to open this up is so our friends... Well, I mean, I assume that basically we are getting this as a safe passage and to get meet up with our friends. But I'm assuming once we get this done, we will maybe have more quests with uh, the whole Tomoe mission, which I think actually I might want to just finish that first because we're close to finishing it. And then once we finish that, we'll, I guess, maybe try to stick with one person's quest chain at a time like Kenji's is only one so we could do that next I thought maybe that shrine would be something cool but it was nothing maybe even get Yuna's stuff done since she only has like the four and we have to do the hit list which has a lot more quests related to it and my monk friend, I don't know. I don't, it doesn't really matter too much what order we do those in. But if we can do the Tomoe stuff and just end it because we only have like two more missions with it, I would like to. Oh, those are just deer. I thought those were Mongolians, which would have been a good time to try to put the armor on. It sounds like with the armor that the, uh, it just makes it so the detection rate is super low. Which makes me wonder, can you run into a camp with it and just, like, go nuts stealthing people? If it takes them long enough to detect you, you can just kind of, like, run in, maybe? And do, like, a big surprise surprise? We still have a lot of fox dens to do, don't we? Well, nine, to be exact now. But just thinking about that, I'm like, oh yeah, lots of stuff. I think we're mostly done with everything else. Uh, I was going to say climbing up here might have been a mistake, but it seems like it's okay. There's the castle we took. All thanks to me. No thanks to uncle. I need to see what's over here. Getting distracted again. Wow, he didn't even see me. Did 
dude didn't even know. Um, I feel like there's really no reason for me to be here. Where'd the guy go that was down here? Is he playing with my horse now? Don't do that. It's my horse. Oh, uh, so this tower was nothing. I'm surprised there were, like, usually when it's like a tower like that, there just isn't anyone nearby. I know the ghost's outfit has, like, the stealth bonus to it. But that was a little ridiculous. Uh, do I need to climb up this way? Was this the fox in that I... Yeah, it was the one I got. Wasn't sure. Because it was like glowing, I thought maybe it was special. Generally speaking, the uh, ghost outfit's pretty nice just for the... fact that it's easier to get ghost up. By like, what, two pips? I know I'm... Kind of going around now because I saw the Crane Mountain Shrine. How many more of those do we need? I, let me just look at the collection. Two more bamboo strikes. There's two more shrines. Three more haiku spots. We almost have all the hot springs as well. Lighthouse. A lot of stuff. I don't know if they give us big rewards, but... Obviously, we'll do it all. These three gates lead to Crane Mountain, Shrine, Sanctuary of Ikazuchi no Kami, Kami of Lightning. I'll finally be able to channel the lightning through my blade. Everyone will be impressed. Preemptively, I figured we had to climb this. I was not wrong. Thought I was going to miss that for a minute. Path is getting a little confusing, but it's working out so far. I've got a lot of swing going on here. I was gonna say, do you think we can make it over there? But I, I don't think we would be able to. Not with the swinging. Almost tried to risk it. I don't care about that flower. At this point, I feel like with all the flowers I have, I should really just buy every color. Like, remember when I was afraid of wasting my flower money just because I really wanted my patchwork straw hat? I don't think there's really anything I want from merchants anymore. Nothing important, anyways. Come on! Jen, I didn't really have that much control over that to decide whether or not I would actually grapple onto that branch. Sometimes the uh, climbing gets a little wonky with branches, I find. And I think I can say that when sometimes when I Use the grapple hook, it just doesn't. There we go. Good job, Jen. First try. It's a bit of a tiny shrine. Still a lovely view. It's a lot of fires kind of behind, I think, where Jen is. Might want to take a look at that. Defense. Perks and abilities that terrify are 25% more likely to occur. That's not bad. Oh, I think that's where we're heading. That looks like that's the uh, 
path through that we want. I need to just find the gate that lets me teleport back down. Alright, back to what we were trying to do. 